Hello, it's day 30. Can you guys believe it? I cannot believe we're on day 30. And I am so excited because even though it's late, it was totally worth it. I just got home from watching, hey, T Christina, from watching the Union Cougars volleyball team win the state championship. So that was so awesome and so fun. One of my best friend's daughters played. She's a sophomore and she starts varsity and she played amazing. So it was so fun to watch them win. Hey, Whitney. And so I don't want to keep you guys on very long tonight. I hadn't, didn't really have a plan for sure of what I was going to do. And then as it got later and later, I'm just trying to do something kind of simple and easy. Thank you so much, Christina. It's been really fun. I did it. I've never done this before. So it's been interesting and I've learned a lot and I've loved it. So yeah, it's been fun. Anyway. So we're going to try to keep this one kind of quick, I hope. That's what I always say, and then it ends up not being that quick. Um, but I'm still, I'm excited about it. It's still a pretty fun one, so hopefully it turns out good. Um, I'm going to start with just putting some base makeup foundation down here on the lower half of my face. We are not going to be covering my entire face with foundation because... We don't need to. So, hey, Frankie, do you have to work tonight? I'm getting a late start because um, my the high school I went to, the, um, the girls' volleyball team went to state, and they played not very far from where I live, so I went to go watch them play tonight. It was awesome because they won the state game. It was so fun. And I got to see some people that I went to high school with. Stuff like that. Hi, Sarah. So that's why we're a little bit later tonight. But again, I'm still going to try to keep you guys not too late. So this isn't going to be too difficult of a look, I don't think. I hope not. Anyways. Hi, Michaela. Don't forget, if you're not following me, make sure you tap that nose. There's going to be three dots that pop up. And turn on your notifications. Because even after this Halloween looks, I will still be going live doing fun things. So you want to make sure you're following. Um, also... If you share this video, I'm doing a drawing on Friday for anybody who has shared. So make sure you let me know when you share. We are going to be giving away one of our new holiday items. So I'm super excited about it and I think you guys will love it. Hi, Brandy. Also, my little grandson is spending the night, so I had to leave him with Papa. He's not asleep yet. So we have to be really quick with this. Um, but yeah, we're getting a sleepover tonight, and I'm, I'm actually really excited about that too. All right, I'm going to be using a lot from this beautiful palette here. This is the Danessa Myricks, um, the metallic eyeshadow palette. So this is what we're going to be using um, also some black and yeah, we'll see how this goes. Um, I think I'm going to start with a little bit of a black base on my face and definitely on the neck area. So we are going to be dipping into our black eyeshadow and... Where is our must do? There it is. I think I'm going to be using must do with it tonight. 
and I'm going to be painting it on. So, again, going in with must do. And the black. Excuse me, this is called due date, not must do. I keep forgetting that they changed the name of this. Hey, Monica. Hey, Mary. Thank you for joining. And this might be a little too light, so we may have to switch over to our um, setting spray because it makes it a lot darker. And I think that that's what we need for this look tonight. Hey, Mandy. So yeah, again, joining late because of the volleyball game, but it was so worth it. Um, they ended up going to a game five. They won the first two matches with this particular team. They won their first two, and then they lost their second two matches. So it went to game five, and they were down. They were not ahead, and it was looking kind of scary. But these girls just have so much heart, and they, I mean, it seems like this is how, I obviously haven't watched all their games live, but from what I saw and reading, They've gone to quite a few of these sudden deaths, but I mean, it's all about heart, you guys. If you have the heart, hey, Lene, hey, Billy, it was the Union Cougars, Sarah. It's just like, if you have heart, you can do anything. And that that's like with anything. You just have to believe and never give up because they so easily could have given up, you guys. So you just have to keep pushing through no matter what, whether it's in business, whether it's in motherhood, because some days you just want to give up, whether it's um, in your job, um, in your whatever, sports, it doesn't matter. Just you got to just keep pushing yourself never ever give up because you just never know and they didn't they did not give up at all and it would have been so easily for them to do it too just coming down a little bit on the neck here and when i that when i take my picture this will look good because i'm not gonna go down very far so this will be the white and the rest of my neck will pretty much be hidden that's why I'm coming down a little ways. So, yeah, it was it was just I don't know. It was so cool, so cool to watch. It's always awesome too when you know people. Hi, Cassidy. Hi, Laura. Hey, Glenda. So, anyways, do you guys, did any of you guys play sports in high school? I did not play sports. I was a cheerleader and I did love it but sometimes I think back and think if I had to do it over again I might I don't know I shouldn't say that because I actually enjoyed being a cheerleader and I mean we got to do a lot of things and see a lot of stuff your cousin's daughter who's your cousin's daughter Michaela that's crazy that's where I grew up oh you're talking about the Allens or Horrocks. Amy's daughter. Is it um not Marley? Marley graduated. 
Oh, uh, what's her name? The, the, um, hang on. Her last name is Taylor, right? Oh, Amy and Cody's daughter. Okay, cool. I didn't know that she played. That's awesome. They won state tonight. Is she, do you know what grade she's in? I didn't see, I didn't see Cody, but I wasn't necessarily looking for him either. Sammy? Sammy, that is, um, Amy and, um, Trent's daughter. Trent, well, that's Trent's her stepdad, but Amy Allen, right? Both of their daughters play? Yeah, I know Amy and Cody are brother and sister. Anyways, I know who you're talking about. Sammy. Sammy Taylor? I didn't even realize she was on the team. That's awesome. Isn't she a junior or senior too, I think? But yeah, I went to school with both Amy and Cody. I remember talking to your sister about them. Okay, I think the neck is almost good. It doesn't need to be perfect for what we're doing. Just... I need to leave it alone because now I'm picking up some that it came off. All right, I'm going to have to go back and fix that. Okay. All right, now I think I need to put a little bit of a base down of black on my face. Hi, Thomas. We're going to have to cover that up with the wig, but it'll be fine. Yeah, it was so fun. Michaela, did you play sports in high school? For some reason, I feel like you would have been someone who played sports. I don't know why. Oops. Oops, guys. I kind of forgot what I was doing here. I don't really want to come down that far on my face. Oopsie. Hi, Angie. Hi, Grandma. Now I gotta fix that. I need to pay attention to what I'm doing. You ran track? That's cool. That's amazing, actually. I wish I loved running. I wish, and I just don't at all. Hi, Deb. Hey, Tacey. Thanks for jumping on. Gosh, now the lighting's being really weird. And I'm certain it's because of the black. Let me see if I can adjust the lighting a little bit. I'm not sure if that's going to help or not. I might have to pull my black on the back up. Let me see. Yeah, let me pull that curtain up. Hang on, guys. Okay. That helps. That helps. All right, here we go. 
fix this again. And pay better attention to what I'm doing. Okay, back to black. <laughs> I hear Hudson in there with Keith, and I'm not sure he's going to last with Papa. Papa doesn't have the magic touch like Mimi does. It was funny because even today when he came here, Keith tried to... talk to him and he was not having him at all. He did not want Papa. He just wanted Mimi. It's cute because now he's starting to be a total like mama's boy. He loves his mama. I think they go through those stages though. Were your kids like mama's boys or mama's girls or daddy's boys or daddy's girls? My girls were definitely mama's girls. Jaden especially. Looks okay. Could you say that again? Oh, Alexa thought I was talking to her, I guess. Mm. Yeah, he's crying. He's not happy. Hi, Richard. That makes me sad. Makes me feel bad. Jaden will be here soon. Maybe she can help. Or we might just have to bring him in. Oh, Dev. <laughs> Sad. He was totally fine when I was in there with him. And he probably is thinking, where's my mama? But he'll be fine. He'll be just fine. He had a good bath. You know when people are awkward and babies sense it? Your nephew's name is Hudson. I think I remember you telling me that, actually. I mean, Keith's just a little awkward with him. He tries and he loves him so much. That looks better. Yeah, I like that better. Yeah, last time you left him, he was a lot s smaller. So... He probably doesn't like, wouldn't recognize as much as this time. Maybe. He's not crying anymore. He's all better. Okay. All right, now we're gonna try to add in some like color to this look. Um, 
think I might try this. I don't even know what brush to use. Maybe I'll try this. Yes, Hudson does love Cass. So we're gonna try to mix in this blue just to give us a little bit of dimension and color up here. I just really wanted to have that black base and I'm hoping that this works. How are you, Debbie? Not sure if this is the best way to do this. Hi, Emily. I don't know guys if this is really going to turn out the way that I was hoping but we're just going to go with it they can't all be perfect right I don't even know what this person is it was just kind of cool it's kind of like a galaxy is what it reminded me of when I saw the picture so I don't know, I'm a little worried. But we're just gonna keep going. Just keep going. And whatever happens, happens. Kinda just making up my own thing here.
Yeah, I just don't even know. I don't even know. I'm just throwing colors on here that look like galaxy colors. But this is how you learn. Just keep on doing random stuff and practicing. And I've definitely learned a lot when I, since I've started doing this, like just about color and blending techniques and all kinds of stuff. So this has been so fun for me because now when I go to do my other makeup, like today I did this really cool look on my eyes, just normal everyday makeup. And you like the purple? It is really cool purple color. And again, I'm just using the Danessa metallic palette with some setting spray. And we're just blending colors to try to make something amazing. Now I'm gonna go in with some green. So we've done some purple, we've done some blue. I'm gonna throw in some metallic green in here. Cause the galaxy just has all these beautiful, incredible, amazing colors. Yeah, I don't know guys, I don't know. See if we can blend this out, kind of get the colors to like meld together, if that's even a word, meld. I don't know, I just made it up. Purple on the forehead, okay, good idea. We'll just throw some purple in here. Ooh, that looks good. Good job. Good call, Monica. Yeah. Okay. Now we're now we're getting somewhere. Good call. See, she's amazing. Monica, you should be doing this. I don't know why you're not. Because yeah. You, you know what's up. So I'm a little sad because I did not go and get like any jewels or anything for this. So we're just working with what I had here lying around the house that I could find at 9 o'clock at night. And going with that, working with that. Okay, what do you think? That actually looks pretty good, doesn't it? Yeah, that looks good. So yeah, we're just working with whatever I could possibly find here at the house, which was not much at all. I found some puff paint. We might use some puff paint. I got that. I found a couple of little jewels. We might use that. And yeah, we're just gonna go from there. So I need to try to make a little moon some moons. Okay. So first off, I think I need to make a circle with concealer. So we're going to go in with concealer zero with this little 
diff round brush. Hi, Angela. And I'm gonna start right here in the middle of my forehead. And it's almost like I'm doing a cut crease. Yeah, I'm using concealer. This, like, well, maybe not. Maybe I will go in with the, um, foundation. Because the concealer isn't working very well. So... Okay, at least I can see the circle. Hi, Chloe. We can see the circle. And I have this white glitter. I forgot I had that. That's going to work, actually. Score. I did not know I had that until I just looked. So I'm going to take this NYX medium right here. I'm gonna put it on my hand and I'm going to mix the white glitter in with it. I am so excited that I found this white, you guys. This is actually gonna work. So I'm just mixing the white glitter with the mixing medium and we're gonna put a moon on the forehead. And I really hope and pray that this is going to work. So again, this is the NYX Body Glitter. The NYX Face and Body Glitter. And I'm using the white color. And I'm trying to make a circle. Does that look like a good circle, guys? There's that little piece that needs to go away right there. There we go. That looks pretty good, right? Do you guys think that looks good? You did a watch party for me? Or was it somebody else's watch party? I'm not sure how those work, honestly. Does this look good, guys? I think that looks pretty good. Okay, now the next one's going to be tricky because um, this is going to be half moons. So we've got the full moon in the middle, and now we need to do two little half moons on each side. So I'm not really exactly sure how we're going to do that, but probably just the same way. I'm going to use this brush. Actually, no, I'm going to use this one. Excuse me, I have the hiccups. <clears throat> and again, I'm going to just go in with my mixing medium. And I'm going to put that right here on my hand. And I might try to apply that to my forehead first this time. 
and then add the glitter. Hopefully this works. Okay. Hi, Christine. I miss you, girl. I hope you're doing good. Watching, I saw that the girls have been playing volleyball. Or I think they just got done playing volleyball. I watched volleyball tonight. My high school that I graduated from went to the state championship game tonight in one state. So that was so awesome and super exciting. A lot of the people I went to school with, their kids played there. Played tonight. It's crazy. All right, guys. I don't know. This isn't the perfect half moon. But it's not horrible. It's not horrible. Is that okay guys? Does that kind of look like a half moon? Kind of. Even if it doesn't, you're supposed to be like, oh yeah, that looks amazing. <laughs> oh, I'm totally kidding guys. Okay, that looks not bad. It doesn't look too bad. Now let's do the other half moon. Because we got to do a half moon on each side. So that's going to be the scary part. Is to try to get them to somewhat match. Alright, let's try to get some of this glitter out. Thank you guys. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That one's a little bit bigger than the other one. The purple is eyeshadow. I used purple and green and blue and black eyeshadow mixed together. from one of our palettes. It's called the Danessa palette. So yeah. Okay. Well, I think that's okay. I think I got them to kind of match and I think that they're gonna be just fine. It does not have to be perfect. You are correct, Monica. You are correct. Now, I do have a couple jewels that I can use. So I think I'm going to use a couple of these purple jewels and I'm going to apply it with um, eyelash glue because it, that comes off easily. So we're going to put a jewel right here and we're gonna put a jewel right here because I did find just a few jewels that we can use for this. So here we go. Hi, Angela. Put 
put that one right there. And that one right there. Whoopsie, come on, get off of there, buddy. There you go. There you go. Yeah, I just found these somewhere laying around the house. But. Hi, Sue. Okay, that looks pretty good. I can go with that. Um, I also think that, okay, so I'm gonna use this other glitter, this silver glitter to add because like I said I don't have a ton of jewel I have these and that's it but I'm going to add little dots of this glitter on my face in little dots since I don't have jewels I'm going to use the glitter instead and I actually think it's going to be fine silver lashes Hmm. Oh, but guess what? The other night, remember I painted them black. I don't <laughs> see. I painted them black. I don't think they're going to work. Maybe, maybe I can get them off. We'll see. We'll see. I actually think I might have some other ones in the bathroom. Okay. But we're going to add random dots of glitter. Yeah, I think I painted them black, Monica. They're the ones that I used the other night. But I might have another pair that are kind of similar. Or I might be able to get the black off. We'll see. I can maybe use a wipe and try to wipe it off. This is working okay. This is just as good as using a jewel. Right? It's again crazy how they start out and I'm like really concerned that they're not going to look good and then they end up looking okay after all. So you just gotta keep going. Like I said earlier, you just don't give up. Just keep on going. Keep doing it. Thanks, Cass. Okay. Now we're going to add some up here. Hi, Janie. Hey, 
think Jaden just got home from work. I hear the shower going. How are you, Janie? How are things going in Canada? Thank you, Sarah. I don't know if my wig is different on this side or what. It's getting cold. It is cold in Utah as well. Very cold. Okay, that looks pretty good. I think. Thanks, Janie. It's been really, really fun, actually. More fun than I thought. All right, we are going to use this white glitter shimmer shadow from the new Alley palette. And I'm going to sprinkle that shimmer. Hey, Leslie, onto my nose. Boom, look at that highlight, guys. Isn't that good? Thank you, Denise, for sharing. You will be entered into my drawing on Sunday, or excuse me, Friday. That glitter, ooh, that looks so good. I love that. I love that. We're gonna do that on the eyes as well. I might have to do it differently on the eyes though. Uh, what am I doing? I would, this is like a galaxy. A galaxy, that's what we're calling it. Um, I need a different brush to put this on my eyes. Thank you, Denise. Ooh. We're gonna tap that into the eye. Oh, that brush isn't really working. Let's try this one. Actually, my finger would probably work just as well as anything. That usually is the best thing when I put shadow on the lid. I tap it on with my finger and it usually works really well. The product is um, all Lime Life by Alcone makeup. It's regular everyday makeup. This is not costume makeup. This is what I use every day. Um, I'll show you the palette that I used to create this look tonight. I used the... Danessa Myrick's Metallics palette, and I did the blue and the purple. And then I did use NYX Glitter, the NYX Body Glitter. Um, but everything else is Lime Life by Alcone products. What I would use for everyday makeup. 
So it's not harmful. It's not toxic. All of our skincare is 100% natural. Free from harmful chemicals. So yeah. All that good stuff. I'm going to add some mascara. And then I'm actually going to add the green eyeliner because I think that that's going to look really super cool. So we're going to put this green. I'm in love with this eyeliner, you guys. I wore it today. And I'm going to put it right here on my waterline. And I should have did it before I put my mascara on. But oh well. Thanks, Mom. I wish I could have taken Maddie to the game with me today. I did not know till super late that I was going to go. But... It was so awesome. Yeah, that actually looks really good. Hey, Joanne. I like that green on the waterline. I love this green eyeliner, you guys. Like I said, I wore it today for my everyday eyeliner. And I loved it. Okay. Yeah, it goes on like butter. It is so smooth. I love it. Okay. Back to bottom lashes. And then we're going to try to wipe off that black from these glitter lashes to see if I can get it off of them. I hope so. Because, like Monica said, this glitter lashes will look really good. If not, maybe we can paint glitter on them. We could do that. That's probably what I'm going to do. Yeah. So I'm going to put these lashes on, and then we might paint some glitter on them. So let's do that. And then we have to do lip. And the lip is like a really dark color in the picture, which is interesting. I have a hair in my eyes. There. Okay, here we go. You can kind of still see the glitter. But I painted these black the other night for a different look because I love the lash. But I didn't like the glitter. Yeah, you can still see the glitter. But we might touch it up with a little bit more glitter. We might have to do that. Okay, other side. Hey, Lindsay. Oh, hang on. Hang on there, buddy. 
I, when I came in here, Astros were losing at the top of the ninth inning. They were down, I want to say, four to two. So, what was the outcome? Let's hear it. Keith was watching it, but I was like, I've got to get in here because I don't want to be doing this all night long. I already felt bad that I was jumping on so late. So, tell me about it. Nationals won 6-2. I actually didn't... What, I mean, I didn't really care who won, I guess. I haven't watched baseball this year. So, I don't really know what, like, all of the... It's like a galaxy, I would call it. Something that I was hoping would be fast because I was at the volleyball game tonight watching the girls play, and it was amazing. Is it? Joanne, I, want, I thought your daughter played volleyball. Does she? Maybe not. Maybe I'm crazy. You do, Shayna? I would love to. This is actually just regular Lime Life makeup. This isn't even body paint or anything. This is eyeshadow. I, all of my looks I have done basically with Lime Life eyeshadow and Lime Life foundation. That's it. And it washes off so easy every single night. But I would love that, Shayna. Hey, Caitlin. Oh, the Nationals have never been. Oh, well, that's... So, I love rooting for the underdog. So, if that's the case, that's who I probably would have rooted for. Unless it's, like, my team. But I didn't have a team. Okay, guys, we're going to try to add some extra glitter to the lashes. So, I'm actually going to take the glue and I'm going to brush it on with one of just my regular old makeup brushes. Oh my gosh, Joanne. It, it was amazing, seriously. I couldn't even believe it. It was so exciting. I got so emotional because they fought so freaking hard. It was incredible. I had such a fun time. Those girls have heart. That's all I can say. They fought till the end. When you think that they like there was no way they were coming back and they did. Okay, so I just brushed that glue and now I'm just brushing the glitter on it to make them more glittery. They played at UVU, Sarah. So I drove down to Provo. Okay, that kind of got in my eyeball a little bit. Probably not a good thing. Shayna, I'll have to message you. And we will have to set up a time. What do you want me to paint? I would love it. I will say, though... I feel like it's a lot easier to do it on myself than other people. I did a Cleopatra the other night for a friend of mine. And I just felt like it didn't turn out as good as... I don't know. It was hard. You would think it would be the complete opposite. That it would be easier to do on somebody else. But for me, it was harder to do on somebody else. Thank you, I'm painting them on. We are just improvising because I did not have glitter lashes. 
So we're making our own. Which is pretty much what I've done with all of my looks. And I haven't done costumes or whatever I've done. Okay. All right, so here's the picture that I was kind of going off of. See how dark her lips are? They're major dark. So we're going to go with that, I guess. It's kind of like this. I'll try it, try it, and then we'll see what we think. We can always change it. Sorry, guys, if I have boogers, don't mind it. <laughs> I've had this. I don't know if I do. I hope I don't. You guys probably weren't even looking, and now you're definitely looking. Hi, Lexi. So this is Berry Coco. <laughs> kind of gross, Denise. I'm sorry. Just keeping it real here. And then I think I'm going to add some highlight to it. My highlight shadow from the Alley palette. Again, we're going to dab. Yeah, well, I'm going to try dabbing it with this white and see what happens. kind of an iridescent. How does that look, guys? Maybe add some gloss, some of our clear gloss to it. If I can find it. I don't know where my bliss gloss is. it. Hang on. Hang on. I found it. Here we go. So we'll try to add the Bliss Gloss. All right, and then we're just gonna pop on a little highlight. Okay, well guys, I think that's a wrap. That wasn't too bad. Not bad at all. 
I almost wonder, do I need to fix the neck or is it fine black? Once I take my picture, if I just take it from like here up with the black behind me, I think it's going to be just fine. Okay, guys. Well, that's our galaxy, galaxy look for tonight. I love it. I think it turned out gorgeous. Um, better than I thought it was going to. And again, thank you guys so much for joining. I appreciate you guys. And we will have a one more look tomorrow. I'm not sure what I'm doing yet. I have an idea. Um, and it's scary. I will tell you that. It's a little more on the scary side. So anyways, again, thank you guys so, so much. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to follow. And I will talk to you guys later. Have a good night. Bye. Mwah. Love you guys. Oh, we got a spray. Set the makeup. Now we're done. Okay, thanks guys. Have a good night. Bye.